Hello everybody and welcome back. Tonight's report is a Wildman's Whoop and a Green Dog, November 2017. This report came in to me in early November 2017 and I wrote, I was contacted today by Mr GB and he asked me if any of our researchers were out on an investigation in the Holway Woods area of Dorset. I advised Mr B that none of our teams were out there this weekend. In fact, I checked amongst the Dorset researchers and nobody had been out in that area that we know of. Mr B went on to explain. I decided to take the dog out for a run today and we set off in the car. We arrived at Holway Woods, everything was quiet and it was a normal, cold, wet day. I didn't see anyone else out there that day, no people around and no cars in the car park. I had only been out of the car a few minutes when I heard what I can only describe as a whoop. It stood out to me as unusual and I turned round expecting to see people, but nobody was back there. It stood out as so unusual, I looked around some more, but I still couldn't see anyone. I decided to whoop back. Why? I don't know, but I just did it in a much deeper voice than normal. But all was quiet, no reply or response, no further whoop. It was puzzling, but I just went on with the walk. Then I noticed what I thought was a greeny, greyish dog running below me amongst the trees. I could not make it out clearly at any point. It was an animal with hair or fur in a strange colour moving below in the trees and brush. I waited for the owner to walk with it or at least catch up to the dog at some point. But there was nobody around, and the dog had just gone. To be honest, I was feeling a bit spooked at this point, so I went back to the car and I went home. Mr B went on to say that this, that close to this area is a place called Sanford Orcus, and historically it has tales of wild men. Indeed, the name Orcus derives from the Latin Roman word for wild man, or ogre, orc. It's also known as the land of the wild man, Sanford Orcus, and with around 10 other encounters in the area, historical and up to date, which also include whoops, howls, screams, and sightings of upright hairy walking figures. This is an area worth investigating, no doubt, and it has all the things we look for when researching the wild man. So if you're out in this area, keep a log of any unusual finds. Now, this is not the only whoops that I have heard of this year in the UK. And there was a gentleman who contacted me on YouTube, and I hope he's listening to this. And he told me that his son had an experience in Sherwood Forest, where he heard what sounded like a monkey's whoop. And we were in contact on email, but I can't find his um, email address. So if you're out there, can you get back in touch with me? Then that would be brilliant, because I'd like to write that report up. As I say, there are... Um, a number of accounts from this year that have included the word whoops and I think we're going to hear more of this um, so I shall go and get on with the other seven that have got to come and uh, I'll get back to you as quickly as I can thank you very much from a very very rainy Lancashire good night